Healthcare Management Introduction by Dr. Richard J. Sands. Do you want to work in a management position within the healthcare field? Then, a career in healthcare management could be the right track for you. People in this field typically help plan, direct, and coordinate health services, manage healthcare offices. Continue watching to learn more about healthcare management. Healthcare management duties. Medical and health service managers take on leadership roles within healthcare offices they can manage. A whole facility or supervise specific services or processes within the facility. Exact job responsibilities can vary based on the workplace expertise and education. Some common tasks include improving the efficiency of an office, creating reasonable goals for your department, hiring and onboarding, supervising staff, monitoring budgets, and managing billing tasks. Healthcare management versus healthcare administration. Healthcare management and healthcare administration may sound similar, but the two fields differ in important ways. Healthcare management is a broad field generally referring to the management of many or all aspects of the healthcare facility or office. This can include the management of staff, budgeting, the development of processes, communication across leadership teams, and other varying tasks. Healthcare administration, on the other hand, typically refers to managing staff. Specifically, some tasks include handling hiring, onboarding and supervision of staff, along with creating schedules and managing scheduling conflicts. Salary and Outlook The outlook for medical and health service managers is positive according to the Bureau of Labor. Statistics employment is projected to grow 20% from 2016 to 2026, much faster than the average. Of all occupations, entry-level salaries for healthcare management can vary greatly based on different factors, including where you live, your years of experience, your education level, and where you work. With an associate's degree in healthcare management, you'll be able to apply for entry-level associate or specialist position with the possibility of moving to higher level positions such as supervisor and manager over the course of your career. Healthcare management jobs. Healthcare management jobs vary depending on your level of education. Degree requirements can run from an associate's degree to a master's degree in business administration. Entry-level positions for those with an associate's degree in healthcare management include front desk supervisor, medical accounts receivable specialist, medical billing supervisor, medical office specialist, office supervisor, to name a few. Jobs that may require a four-year degree, master's degree, relevant experience and or additional certification include health information management director, health manager, office manager, practice administrator, program manager, clinical manager, to name a few. Education and skills. Educational requirements vary depending on the role, employer, and other factors. Associate degree programs can prepare you for entry-level positions in healthcare offices and facilities, with the possibility of moving up the management ladder throughout your career. Many direct management positions require a bachelor's degree or higher. Degrees for these fields usually have curriculums that focus on healthcare and business management. Some possible courses for healthcare management include accounting, healthcare law, business office operations, human resource management, and medical terminology. In addition to education and experience, there are also some general skills required to work in healthcare management. These include analytical skills, detail-oriented technical skills, leadership skills, and interpersonal skills. Licensure and certification. If you want to be in healthcare management, licensing and certification can vary based on your job and place of employment. For example, 
nursing home and assisted living administrators require licensure in all states. In addition, some states may require you to pass a state-specific exam. So, if you move somewhere else, you'll need to understand how that affects your licensing. Aside from nursing homes and assisted living facilities, licensing isn't usually required for professionals in healthcare management. Unless you want to focus specifically on nursing or social work programs. In that case, you may need to be registered and or have licensing in those areas as well. I hope I've provided you with an understanding of what healthcare management is and what people in this field typically do. If this field sounds right for you, then you might want to consider an education and a career in healthcare management. Please comment below with any questions you might have for me about healthcare management. Please make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. Thank you for watching.